Welcome, Patriot, to Boston Common, the start of the Freedom Trail. Feast your ears and learn more about the historic Freedom Trail. And learn the history of Boston Common. I'm interested in the history of this place. Let us go back hundreds of years. It is the year 1775. For seven years, thousands of British soldiers have camped on this very soil in their orderly rows of tents led by General Thomas Gage. They seek to quell the growing tide of revolution the night of April 17. The officers are assembled, General Gage. Four days prior, I received word from the Earl of Dartmouth. We have our orders. Lieutenant Colonel Smith, gather 21 companies of our best men and carry them with the utmost expedition and secrecy to Concord. Once there, you will seize and destroy all artillery, ammunition, provisions, tents, small arms, and all military stores. But what of the columns, General? Take care that the soldiers do not plunder the inhabitants, or hurt private property. But we can and must defang them. So, near midnight, Colonel Smith marched with 700 redcoats to face brave American patriots in the Battle of Lexington and Concord, and thus the Revolutionary War began continue on the trail to walk through more of our great city's history. Welcome, Patriot, to Boston Common, the start of the Freedom Trail. Tell me about the Freedom Trail. Starting here at Boston Common, follow the red path as it winds its way through our great city's streets. Markers on the trail are placed at many famous historic sites. See Paul Revere's house, the old North Church, the old State House, Bunker Hill, and many more. Seven and A. Some sort of code? Thank you. 
Who and A. Three, all right. 